Hello people, I have a grocery haul for you today. I went to the grocery store and I feel like I was there forever. I was just walking like a sloth. And really I was only there for like an hour, I think. Uh, but I went without the kids, so it felt like a lot longer than that. It was very blissful. Um, yeah, so hopefully this is my last grocery haul before I have this baby. And um, so many people were like, you're about to pop what are you doing out and like when are you due and just look the look on their faces when i was like oh i was due yesterday um it was fun <laughs> watching they're like what are you doing out like what am i supposed to do just sit in bed until i go into labor anyway um so i'm hoping this is the last grocery haul i have before i have the baby but it probably won't be um so i picked up a whole bunch of stuff it's becoming a theme now that like nothing was planned. I didn't have any meals planned and I was just, um, I was like, mm, I'm hungry, that looks good, that looks good. So let me show you what I've got. Okay, here is all of it. Holy cow. All right, so first things first, the most delicious thing. I got my husband a cheese Danish ring. He hasn't had one literally in like six years. If you are new to my channel, we used to be dairy free. And since I have reached the end of my pregnancy, I've kind of thrown that rule out the window. You know what I mean? So I think he's really going to enjoy this. I also got some bread for roll for not for rolls, bread for rolls, really bread for sandwiches because I'm just craving the carbs and the sugar. Yum. Um, this, the uh, Brussels sprouts, oh my gosh, I found a recipe where you just wrap these in bacon and then throw them in the oven. Holy cow, I'm gonna try it out. I love Brussels sprouts anyway. Got an onion, cucumber. These were three for six dollars, these blackberries. Can you believe it? What, it's usually like one for six, but I couldn't pass up that deal. Got some cabbage, lettuce, bananas. I got four bags of pre-packaged salad because look at this. Look at what this kind is. Spinach and bacon. What? I could not pass. I was like, bacon? What? And then this is like true blue. I don't know. I'm guessing like blue cheese. And then this is, this one's heavy. Apple, cheese, and walnut. So I'm excited for those. One of my husband's favorite salads is <laughs> at Applebee's. I don't even know if they have it anymore. We haven't been to Applebee's in like, we call it Crapplebee's. We haven't been there in like 10 years. And uh, yeah, they sell, They used to have this like spinach bacon salad. Moving along. Uh, what's here? Bell peppers. I plan on making stuffed bell peppers because it's super simple and I'm super lazy. Uh, what are these? Whole strawberries. I, these are just for smoothies. Got some, I can't even reach across the counter. Oh, cereal. We don't do a lot of cereal, but um, I figure once I have the baby and I'm not gonna wanna make breakfast for everyone, so I'm gonna be like, eat some cereal. I also got these because it's delicious. Holy cow, got these, buy one, get one free. The best cookies in the world if you're going to like a cookie, a holiday cookie exchange, oh, make those. I promise you, everyone's going to love them. Um, got some egg noodles, um, either, I might make soup with those. I also got some chicken broth over here for the soup. Anyway, I'm skipping items. Apples here. My daughter, we haven't had apples in like a week, and she's like, can I have an apple? And I'm always like, I don't have any. And when your kids ask for something healthy and you don't have it, you, you know, basically, you're a bad mom. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, frozen broccoli. Some grapes here. I got some ground cinnamon and applesauce. I plan on making um, like cinnamon ornaments. Do you know what I mean? Like it's with these two ingredients and then glue and supposedly they smell good. But I need a cup of cinnamon and I'm realizing this is probably is not a cup. I should have just gone to Sam's Club and gotten cinnamon. I'm sure it would be the same price for like one of those honking ones. I don't know. I got some canned salmon. So last time I got canned salmon, it had bones in it and I was not able to make salmon cakes, so I was super disappointed. So I'm still craving them, craving them slash wanting them. <laughs> I don't even if, know if people have cravings this late in pregnancy. Anyway, I still have cravings all my life because that's how I am. So I'm gonna make some. Oh my gosh, there's an ant on my toe. Get off. 
All right, so did I get all that? Oh, some crackers because I want to make a cheese ball. I've been like dying to have a cheese ball ever since Thanksgiving. I made a couple and I want some more. I got these, oh my gosh, if you haven't had these, my family thinks I'm crazy and they think that they taste like the inside of a popcorn, like the, like the kernel. I think they are delicious. I love the salt. Oh my gosh, I didn't get, take advantage of that coupon. Ah, oh, shucks. Anyway, got this, never had it before. What is this, creamy Parmesan chicken? I don't know, I guess you just throw some chicken in a pot. And um, yeah, this is the sauce and you call it a day with some sides. My daughter has been begging me for gummies, so I figure I'll make her happy. Why not? Can't, there's not many things in life that make my oldest daughter happy. <laughs> so this will be one of those things. Um, Italian seasoning. This is, that stuff is awesome. What do I have here? A pound of salami, a pound of ham. I have some yogurt covered pretzels. This stuff, we make popcorn a lot and my kids love this stuff. Mm, it is quite delicious, not gonna lie. And Ermagerd, guys. Veggie straws with trolls on the package. I don't know why they do this, but I knew that would also make my oldest daughter happy because of course they're obsessed with trolls now because it's the new latest movie. <laughs> and um, I saw these and I was like, she would like those in her lunchbox, I'm sure, and I need I need to find like quick items for her lunchbox, hence the gummies and these, because if I do go into labor, I know my husband may make lunch and I wanted to make things easier on him, <laughs> as easy as I can. Um, these were buy one get one free pasta sauces. This is just some cream of chicken soup, some ground turkey here. These were like a dollar. I don't know. Again, with the breakfast items, I am in such a rut with like recipes and stuff and I'm obviously super lazy so I got those for the mornings what about this oh got some bread here some more bread this is these are my daughter's favorite and she'll actually eat sandwiches if I pack them in this I mean fingers crossed hopefully we have no idea what she ever really wants to eat um this two pizza crusts I don't know it was on sale and I was like sure why not if you know, that's something easy that maybe my husband might be able to put together for dinner. You know, that pizza crust, some pizza sauce, cheese and pepperoni, and then he's done. Uh, he's never made it before, but <laughs> I think I think he may be able to handle that. Eggnog for him. He's already indulged himself. Yes, this is one I just got home from the grocery store, and that is how much he drank already. Um, what do I have here? Pretzels over there. And over here, I just have just a couple of eggs, four cartons, um, some chocolate almond milk, some regular almond milk, orange juice, some cheese here. What kind of cheese? Oh, because I want to make those cheese balls. I also have some feta cheese. It's my daughter's favorite. Um, what's this? Butter. Yeah, because we're out. Uh, some more cheese, if you can believe it. My husband likes Monterey Jack on his eggs in the morning. And then these were buy one, get one free bacon. Yum. I think I'm pretty sure I still have like two pounds of bacon in my freezer, but I was like, buy one, get one free. I can't say no to that. I will freeze it and uh, eventually use it up. Holy cow. Is that everything? Woo. I, that is everything. <laughs> now I have to figure out what I'm going to make for dinner. I don't, I have no idea. Uh, probably take out. <laughs> My husband offered to make dinner, but he, he never makes dinner. So it's nice of him to offer, but uh, maybe take out for dinner is what's going to happen. <laughs> no, I'll try to find something easy to make, but I'm um, grab some chicken and I'm trying to dethaw it. Wait, the water's not even covering the chicken. It's not even covering the chicken all the way. Whatever. Anyway, <laughs> I'll turn that off and do that after I turn the camera off. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye. I don't want to put this stuff away. <laughs> I don't want to. Oh my gosh, look what my husband did. <laughs> I guess I guess he wanted to save it for later, so he <laughs> he put a Ziploc bag over his eggnog. That's hilarious. All right, guys. Wish me luck because now I have to find space for all of this. <laughs> At least I'm progressing, even if it's just a little bit. And selfishly, I'm like, whatever. Like, I have another week to get Christmas shopping done and get 
uh, you know, everything else that I need to get done around the house done and I've got one more week. <laughs>